Hey, I'm excited to be with you on today for this week's podcast. You know, this podcast used to be entitled She See on Inspires, and I changed the name to Arise with Yakinia Marie because it's just a, it's something that the Lord gave me last year about arising, arising to a higher place in Him and a higher place in your assignment. And so on this week, and my goal is to at least come give you like a three minute nugget, you know. Now, if the Lord leads me to go longer, I will, but I, my goal is to at least um, just drop a nugget uh, for three minutes. So, um, I was thinking about assignments. I was thinking about our um, call and our purpose, um, our God-given purpose. Let me say that because sometimes our purpose is not in alignment with what God's purpose is for us, okay? See, we may be driven by passion, driven by money, driven by people, driven by fame, but God has something over here, but we can't see it or we want align with it because we are allowing ourselves to be led by the lust of the flesh, the lust of the eyes, and the pride of life, okay? And so, uh, coming in alignment with God, you will be amazed at the things that your flesh desires, God will automatically give to you. But your motive won't even be there. Your, your, your desire will be specifically to obey and to please God, right? And to empower his people. I know it all too well. I know what it looks like to, uh, for my pursuits to be in the wrong direction. And that actually is a form of idolatry. Okay, it really, really is. Anything that takes your t attention from God is a form of idolatry. But so today I just really wanted to spotlight um, the power of aligning your will with God's will. The, uh, the power of giving up what you desire for what God has already mandated for your life. And you will be amazed that you're going to be so fulfilled when you really walk in your assignment. And some of us, we know what our assignment is, but we're allowing fear to paralyze us. So I want to encourage you not to be bound or, or, or handcuffed by fear because God didn't give us a spirit of fear. He gave us the spirit of power, love, and a sound mind. And he has already set it up for us to win. As we begin to say yes to God, you will see doors open for you. You will see connections connect with you. You will see information be given to you. And God will download information to you as well so that you can walk out the call boldly. But it's all about yielding your will to his will so that you can walk in divine, your divine assignment with God strategically and intentionally. So I'm excited for you. And I look forward to God using you mightily in the earth. God bless you.